captain asked to pour fuel on them. Light a match. Would you follow his order? Of course. An order by a commanding officer must be followed. It's kind of like the story of mutiny dating back to July 17th, 1944. Do you remember this? Heard of it? The Port Chicago mutiny involved African-American enlisted men in the U.S. Navy who refused to return to reloading ammunition after a disastrous explosion at Port Chicago, California, July 17, 1944. This incident destroyed the Liberty ship SSEA Bryan. Sailors and dock workers were pressed for time from their superiors and were practicing unsafe unloading methods. These methods, all widespread practice on munition docks, at the time, despite their danger, led to a munition ship explosion that killed all Navy men on the E.A. Bryan and many Navy dock workers on shore. All told, 320 sailors, 202 of whom were African American, were instantly incinerated in the explosion. An order is an order. That son of a bitch! Natalie, are you okay? I think so. I just hit my head on the dashboard. I'll be right back. <laughs> 